This is Mason Weaver. I'm at the VA hospital in, uh, in Florida, Western Florida, Southwest Florida. And this is my third trip to a VA facility on a service connected disability. Uh, I'm supposed to be seeing a physical therapist, annual checkup, stuff like that. And it's been one bad mistake after another, going to the wrong place, a problem's misplaced and all that. So this morning I got up, I decided to to um, check the appointments online to make sure I had my apartment for the day. And online, the apartment system was down. You could not get your appartment. And my apartment was eight o'clock this morning, which means I could not call anybody ahead of time. So I drove the uh, 20 miles down here early in the morning, parked my car, got in, walked in and stand in line. They didn't have no idea who I was. They didn't have me in the books. Ladies are very nice, very polite. And so I'm, you know, I'm going, I'm scheduled now for February, you know, <laughs> and, and so I'm thinking, as I walk up to the building, look how big this building is. It's way back there, the building in the back too, all the way down here, all this parking up here, all this parking. Um, think about the, the, the hundreds of employees here being paid, the insurance, the construction, the maintenance on this building, all the equipment in here, the equipment, the lab equipment, the medical equipment, the cafeteria, think about this. Why can't I go to a local doctor? On my VA card, I have the little little uh, data strip. I can go in there and give them my data strip. They can build a VA. They can close this building down, put this money in the pockets, uh, open a college or something, a school or something, and not have us veterans come here and deal with this every day, every day, all day, and across the nation. They have um, different regions for VA. Each region is a kingdom run by a, a king, and you have to register in that kingdom to get services. I went from San Diego to Hawaii and left my medication at home and had to go to VA and register in the VA before I can get my medication, I had to register. Same thing when I went to Florida, came from Missouri, I had to register. You gotta come spend hours, hours getting in the system to get service when you're, you're a veteran. They should know who you are. I, <laughs> It's insane. So look at the mil the billions of dollars we're spending on these VA hospitals. If you close these VA hospitals down and let the veteran go to a private doctor to be billed to VA, it'll save money, it'll save time, it'll save frustration, the service are better. And some of these doctors actually come from other hospitals here. They come from other hospitals. You have to pass their hospital. They both have to leave their hospital. You got to drive by the hospital to come here to VA. So I'm just wondering, what are we going to do about this? Hey, combat veteran, how you doing, buddy? All right, how you doing? Excellent, man. Yeah. Vegas is a very, very, very special place for me. Uh, this is the place where warriors gather. These are the wounded that gather here. And how, how do you treat them? We, we got all companies. My guy was old, and he was working hard. Why can't he go to a local doctor, his own doctor, and give the bill to V? Now, Trump did try this little thing, and they, they tried it, and it's, is working, you gotta register and you gotta ask for permission, all that stuff, and sometimes you get a yes, sometimes you get a no. I'm a veteran, I'm an adult male. My morning has been ruined again. I could be doing something productive, but I can't. I gotta be a VA. Close it down, disband the VA, put the money back in the budget, and let's take care of our veterans. This is Mason. Stay right or be left, it's up to us. God bless you guys.